have two developments right now in the teacher strikes in Haverhill and in Malden. Negotiations are underway in both cities, and a court is ordering Haverhill teachers to get right back to work. Schools in both communities stayed closed today, and now parents need to worry about tomorrow. Now, the court order is not expected to change anything right now in Haverhill. The union says the strike is still on. We have team coverage from contract negotiations to the major impact this is having on families. We start with WBZ's Christina Hager in Malden with the issues dividing teachers and their districts. How many of you are still fired up now? While classes were out, a rally in the rain at Malden City Hall instead. Just to show teachers respect. Yeah. Political leaders throwing their support to striking teachers who spent the day dancing and chanting. One, two, three, four, students are who we're fighting for. The same situation playing out more than 30 miles north in Haverhill. For cities compared to cities, we're at the bottom. At issue in both cities, demands for higher teacher wages at a time when communities across Massachusetts and the country are dealing with major staffing shortages. We've had a lot of teachers and administrators that we've trained and grown here in Malden, and they've left to go to other districts that have higher pay, better working conditions. According to the Malden School Department, the city offered teachers and administrators a 4% raise during the first year and for support staff, 24 percent. And in Haverhill? We have offered over 20 million dollars in raises in our financial package. Still not enough to be competitive, say teachers. As for students... I think we deserve better as students. Some spent their day at school anyway, supporting their teachers. Without teachers' pay, students aren't receiving the, the level of education they deserve. In Haverhill, a judge up in that county has issued an injunction ordering the teachers to stop striking immediately. But the teachers union in Haverhill says they plan to continue striking until there's an agreement. Meantime, there is some hope in both cities. Negotiating teams are at the table. In Malden, Christina Hager, WBC News.